Hello, good evening, and welcome to Limbic TV. Uh, welcome to the internet, the internet gig. Uh, tonight we have the fabulous uh, Yoko Poro. I'm getting good at saying that name. It's taken a year or two. Um, and Yoko Poro, are, they're, they're going to debut the new album, Part Machine. So I'm uh, kind of like super excited about that. Um, let's go over to the guys. Hello, Yoko Poro. Hey, hey, oh, let's get people unmuted. Hey, right. Hey. Yay, I can hey. hear you all. Um, thanks so much for coming down, guys. Uh, I'm just going to get Lisa unmuted from a... There we go. Hey. 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 Um, so you're going to play... Are you going to play the whole album? No. No. Uh, <laughs> no, uh, so the album includes two tracks that are uh, collaborations with other bands. Uh, a band called Acolyte, who we did the Black Cat with, that was out in October. We're playing with them in Glasgow on Friday. And another band called Jansky from Mallorca. Uh, but they're in Mallorca, they're not here. So we can't, we can't do that. However, they will also be in Glasgow on Friday. Um, so we're not playing either of those tracks. We're doing almost all of the rest of them, I think. Great. We, so missed, that's we missed out the one, the one track of pounding, banging techno where we all stand about staring at our shoes. Great. Oh, I, I would like to see that. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we can do it afterwards, that's fine. Okay. It's just not going out live. Um, so people can see the whole thing in uh, Glasgow this weekend? Yeah, so we're in Glasgow on Friday, which is the 15th, I believe, and then we're in Edinburgh on Saturday the 23rd, so the following Saturday. Uh, we're playing with Acolyte at both gigs and our good friend Iona Zavinsky as well. Um, and Jansky as well will be joining us from Mallorca on Friday in Glasgow. Amazing. It's good to hear that the world is opening up again. Uh, what you, what's the first track going to be? Uh, this track is called Tourmalay. Yeah. We're good? Not quite. Gary, do you want to tell us a wee bit about the genesis of this track? Uh, hey, where's that? Ah. Uh. Gary, I'm gonna. I've lost that mic. I'm gonna come back to you at the end of and and pick that up. Um, <laughs> and yes, Gary. Thank you. I will. <laughs> Tourmalet is a pub in Leith where Gary wrote this tune and a great many others while consuming sensible and responsible amounts of alcohol. Yeah. <laughs> we good.
How long have you waited to play that track live? Uh, I think we'll be waiting a wee while longer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, it has been near enough, I think. That's right, Lissa. Hey. Yes. Words. <laughs> For sure. Yeah. All of these tunes sort of had their genesis over uh, over lockdown. So um, yeah, the, all of us together playing in a room is a complete novelty. Yeah, we did this all from home, basically, in our own homes, not just one home, like separate homes, and then put it all together in one place. I mean, we're kind of in different rooms just now. I know, yeah, so it's, it's kind of like how we made it, yeah. You're in Norway. That, that booth over there is, is called Norway. That's why you can't hear Lewis. It's because he was in Norway. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it looks like a good Nor uh, Norwegian jumper. That you have on there, Lewis. Uh, it's been cold here in Edinburgh. I don't know. Is it? it has been. Okay, well, crack on, guys, uh, and give Lovely. us another tune. This next track is called Cornstar. Um, somebody recently suggested that this might be a reference to people um, who post pictures of their tea on the internet, which is better than the truth, so we're sticking with it. <laughs> better than the truth. Okay. This one, we, we've got a video out for this one as well. We do, indeed. You can watch us doing exactly this, playing it live, but at Piano Drum instead of here. We all good? Sweet. Let's do it. Animals were animals. Animals were animals. Animals were animals. Uh, animals were animals. Animals were animals. Animals were animals. Uh, animals were animals.
animals were animals, 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 were animals, animals Hey. hey, hey, I could see them dancing to that. Let me see if I found Gary. Gary, speak into that mic. Is that? Hey, I have, I found you. Say hello to everyone, Gary. Uh, hello. And, uh, Gary, I, this is your first time playing with a band, isn't it? Uh, it is, yeah, after however many years. It's, uh, was it two years we've been writing this thing? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, I originally pitched it to Callum that I would just learn the tunes on banjo in exchange for free festival tickets. And he took me earnestly and made me join the band for real. <laughs> wow. Because uh, previously you were just kind of getting uh, munted in the audience uh, at the gigs, yeah, right? I was on the other side of the fence, <laughs> you know, kept away by security guards at a fire distance. Brilliant. <laughs> uh, I'm loving what you're doing at the banjo. And, uh, those uh, crazy affected sounds. Uh, what do you have next, guys? Uh, we have a track called Horace's, which is a tribute to another bar. One a bit further afield in New Orleans. Uh, Horace is a legend of a man that just sits at the bar playing cheesy 2000s R&B and drinking all day. And uh, I don't know, he, he has a nice bar. I enjoyed it when I was there. <laughs> so I wrote this track in tribute to him and then we contacted him to try and get some vocal samples on it. I don't think he remembers who we are. So uh, Right. I'm sure he'll find out about it eventually. We might post him an album, but... Back to the bar. You can take an, al take a, an album. Yeah, well, you'll, you'll get it in the post. I don't think you'll understand why. Great. <laughs> I love it. I love the surrealism of that. If, if he is watching this, hello, Horace. <laughs> remember us. Uh, John <laughs> Clark. Uh, people that showed up to your bar one time. John Clark and uh, Craig Peacock are watching. They say excellent and awesome stuff. Oh, magic. Cheers, guys. Magic. Cool. Okay. Uh, well, let's uh, play your hearts out to this guy in New Orleans.
You'll be getting hot, Lewis, in that booth. You keep jumping up and down like that. Yeah. Yeah. What energetic. And the jumper is off. <laughs> the jumper is off. Um, it's cold enough. Um, great. Norway's a great country, actually. It's really good to visit. Can't confirm. Oh, he visited and then he stayed. <laughs> yeah. I, I uh, went to a place called Bu. Bu? Yeah. Um, which is brilliant. Amazing trains. Trains. Yeah. Okay. Bu trains. And uh, it's uh, spelt B O with a line through it. Bu. Cool. Uh, Scott McCafferty says, Junes. Hey. Hey. Mr. Scott McCafferty! Hey. Yes! Uh, Hello, sir! And David Blair says, Mon the Yoko Pono! And uh, can he wait for the Room 2 gig on yes. Friday? And uh, Sigurd Watt says, Och, I a banger! Oh, hey. Yeah. Hey. Get well soon, Siggy! <laughs> yeah, oh, is he, does, is, uh, does he have the. He's got the plague. The plague. Yeah, one of our lighting guys has it. I thought you were hoping he'd get cured of jazz. <laughs> <laughs> oh, not that plague. <laughs> Whoops. Cool. What do you have next? Sorry, Siggy. <laughs> the next track is called The Old Light Bulb. Uh, could I, Dave, can I just ask for a little less of my fiddle, please, and a little more of Lewis's fiddle, please? A little less of yours and a, a little more of Lewis's. There Thank we you. go. Great. Um, what's this one going to be? The old light bulb. The old light bulb is a, a reference to a, a joke. <laughs> famous joke. How many folk musicians does it take to change a light bulb, Dave? How many? Oh, uh, a, a hundred. One to do it and 99 people to write a ballad about it. Yeah, yeah. Ni <laughs> at least <laughs> 90, ni the 99 to sing a song about how they preferred the old light bulb. Ah, that's it. That is it. I have heard that before. Brilliant. Yeah. Yes. Fantastic. Uh, okay, take it away.
Lewis, uh, how was the whiskey making? Hi, the whiskey making was great. It was, uh, it was a smashing wee island. Uh, and it was? Well, I mean, it still <laughs> is. It still is. <laughs> um, the, uh, <laughs> yeah, I, I assume it has not succumbed to some tragic fate in the uh, in the wilds of the North Sea, but uh, you never know. Um, it was pretty wild, but uh, and it was uh, I was great being away over there, and and I, I um, you know, it's, it's actually a pretty great job making whiskey. Um, it's as, exactly as cool as you think it is, like just sort of. <laughs> um, like, Brilliant. you know, filling up a big, remember, filling up a big bucket with, with new make spirit at the end of the day going, well, don't need to go to the shops, do I? I but remember, boys and girls, if you do work doing whiskey and, and you're, you're trying to taste the whiskey as you go, remember to spit it out and not swallow it. Lewis didn't used to wear glasses when he went to Norway. has deteriorated. Yeah. His foot has deteriorated a couple of times <laughs> yeah, as well. Yeah, my feet may have deteriorated as well, yeah. But that's Ma another story. Many years ago, whis uh, whiskey distilleries allowed the people that worked in them to have a dram at lunchtime. Oh. Uh, and they stopped this practice. And I was doing a health and safety conference, and uh, they were they were outlining the, the benefits of uh, of the of stopping it. Accidents fell by eighty five percent. Yeah, I can quite believe that. Uh, yeah. Sorry, Gary, you were going to speak. I knew a guy who used to deliver uh, beer and whiskey to pubs, and they would give him a nip and a pint for every delivery. Oh, <laughs> pubs that he would drive to in his van. Ooh. So he was this in the seventies? Round round a lamppost and pulled it out of the ground when he drove away. <laughs> Whoa, that's insane. Uh, Mona Glenny says, uh, she, "I think this is my favourite off the album. I'm not sure when that remark came in. Whether it was during the, this track or the last one." Uh, Dan Monk says, "Gone," and Cameron Bradley says, "Put a donk on it." <laughs> that's code for cowbell, right? I've been trying to put a donk on it for years, Dave, but my donks keep getting rejected. Ooh, one day, one day, you know. Don't, did, don't we, did we not put a donk on the tune that we're not playing? No, man. No, is that no, not no. quite a donk? It's not a donk. There, was a, there was a whole conversation about whether or not we could make Gabber with a jig. Jabber. Gabber. Oh, Gabber with a jig is getting approval from our video uh, <laughs> department from Sophia there. <laughs> 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 Great. Okay, let's give us some gava with a donk then. <laughs> Put a donk on it, take one.
there's, there's thousands of people here. Uh, Cameron says, Ali's right foot is a f essentially a donk. <laughs> so, don't know how you... Yeah, that one. And Mora Glen Lenny says, uh, Hector's. Horaces? He Hector's. Uh, there is a bar called Hector. There is. Unless, she's, nice. unless she's renamed one of our tunes and not told us. <laughs> um, Alex Weir uh, says hello. Hey, hey Alex. Alex. You know what? Never actually made a mention for uh, Callum on his sax, sax solo in, in, in Hector's or Horace's. That was, that was, that was Callum's sax, sax solo. That was amazing. That's really interesting that you should say that because I completely bottled it. <laughs> you still did it really well. <laughs> I feel so supported. Thank you. <laughs> Support. Oh, that didn't work. Oh, sorry. I was <laughs> sorry. I was I was just sort of trying to uh, sort of uh, neatly get the effects out the way there. Sorry. Support. <laughs> no, I was trying to be weird. <laughs> Good. That's okay. We like weirdness. Um, <laughs> so it's not the same Alex weird as I know. Then uh, it's probably the most prolific writer I've ever met. You can go out for a loaf of bread and come back, and Alex has written a concept album. <laughs> <laughs> you know, Could, Could be the same Alex. Alex Weir, yeah. He's a sax player with a beard. And a, and a shaved head. Yes. Aye. Is he, uh, did he play in a band called Slaphead? Maybe. It sounds plausible, but honestly. Yeah, maybe it is. Alex, did you play in a band? I know Alex from Big Fat Panda. Aye. It probably is. I mean, he kind of plays everything. Yeah. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sex and trumpet and everything. Yeah, and he just chucks out the, the m most mental albums. It, it takes him an afternoon or something. Well, there you go, Alex. <laughs> uh, it's like, I mean, he's, he's probably writes as, of, as much as somebody like Frank Zappa. It's ridiculous, <laughs> you know. There you go. It just comes out of him all the time. Sorry, I, I wander off. Give us <laughs> another tune. <laughs> and hello, Alex, if it's you. And hello, Alex, if it's not you. <laughs>
couldn't I couldn't spoil that uh, spooky end. <laughs> it's like I thought those spooky flutes would never end. Yeah, uh, that was very spooky. That was like uh, one of those dank, hardy nights when you're walking through Edinburgh in the dark. Like uh, Isabel Knox is uh, sounding great, guys. Um, and Morag said meant horses. Uh, <laughs> Well, she, say, she also says, I'm in bed, Afi, no wheel, my brain has gone walkabout. Aww. Oh, well, get well <laughs> soon, Morag. Yeah, get better soon. It's good to have you here. And, uh, Thanks for watching. Alex says, thanks, y'all. Uh, <laughs> you know, it's only when you meet people like Alex, we are, you sort of go, oh, well, the human race does have some interesting prospects. <laughs> you know. Um, <laughs> it's, it's true, though. There's not many people like Alex. <laughs> Great. Hey, uh, give us another tune, guys. Oh, oh, I've been missing loads of people out on uh, YouTube. Oh, no. I tech. Do you know what I tech? I love this band. <laughs> And uh, Murray Graham. Yeah. Uh, clearly, clearly, YouTube's a bit seedier than Facebook. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Murray says uh, three, three. I don't know what that means, but but you guys do. Right. Okay, not asking. <laughs> not asking. Uh, thank you so much for coming in. Uh, it's been a delight to. To hear this album being given birth to, I guess. Well, it is a delight to be showing it to you all. We are su super. Th th I'm trying to explain how excited we are to <laughs> share it with you. <laughs> it's a been so long. A huge shout to uh, Ian Copeland. Yeah. A huge shout to Ian Copeland who um, sort of uh, kind of facilitated a lot of the remote bits of the recording process and sort of mixed and produced the album as well. Like Did he? Put a huge amount of work into this. Hey, well here's to Kopi. Indeed. He's, um, he's good at instigating and get, making things happen, isn't he? Indeed, a conscientious worker. I think it's <laughs> well, if anybody can make Lewis do anything, it's Kopi. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it wasn't making whiskey, was it? With the two of you up in the Highlands <laughs> making whiskey and growing grass and wow. all I'm not that. saying that the two weren't related. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Isabel Knox is Lewis's mum, by the way, and as far as we know, Lewis hasn't been doing anything illegal, Isabel. <laughs> um, yeah, you can tell from the jumper. You know, that's very respectable. Good law-abiding jumper. Absolutely, yeah. <laughs> That's how you get away with crimes in Norway. I learned that straight away. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it was in inter international waters. <laughs> okay. Yeah, you can you can get this album by the way from uh, skyrecords.com. That sky is in the island. S K Y E records.com forward slash part machine dot php. There are a bunch of different ways to buy it. You can buy a CD. You can have uh, downloads, and you can also sign up to. Um, Sky Records website and get access to the whole of their uh, the whole of their catalog on subscription, um, and I mean you know uh, uh, very few people have uh, played the the kind of oh is it not on Spotify yet card with us guys but I think it's really important for artists like us and as I say you know Ian Sky Records has done a lot to support us and facilitate it and it's really good to give things back to we labels and showing them some support because without people like that and organizations like that bands like us don't get to do things like this yeah I, 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 it's it's not like you're doing anybody a favor either sky records is a great we label yeah if you sign up you'll get tons of great music all kinds of stuff yeah yeah, sure. yeah absolutely um brilliant thanks for saying that because i'm surprised at how many musicians put all their stuff on spotify and there's one band came in and he said, we've had 10,000 plays. Oh man, we got 14 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> 14 pounds, jeez. <laughs> Sandwich for that. Yeah. That's, it, that's two and a half pints. I know, I know. <laughs> two years work for two and a half pints. Uh, <laughs> a Sunday. Cool. Um, cool. Uh, 
let's hear the next track then. Cool. This is Mercedes Gleitzer. Cool. Dylan? Cool. There weren't many, there weren't any sports women really. Helen, um, sorry, sorry, I took your feather out there. Please start that again so that everybody can hear what you said. Yeah, yeah, hi. So yeah, I wrote this uh, tune about Mercedes, who's this really inspirational swimmer and sports person and, and philanthropist. She did loads of great stuff in the early 1900s when there really weren't many sports women around at all. She v Rolex even sponsored her when she was doing her swims. And she was the first British woman to swim across the channel. But that was just a small amount of what she did. Um, but some of my favourite stories about her from reading the book about her were things like she'd be like falling unconscious in the water and they'd be like, right, you need to get out now. This is, you can't keep going. And every time they tried to get her, she'd like swim away from the boat and they had to get a net to catch her, <laughs> <laughs> like pull her out of the water. <laughs> She's great. <laughs> it's just for the film, I think, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's coming out soon. I think yeah, yeah. they started making it just before COVID, so it was a bit delayed. Oh, they should, they should pay us for our tune then. <laughs> yeah, yeah, they should. Yeah. <laughs> Take note, I will take note. Right. <laughs> jungle bangers? Yeah, I mean, this is a jungle banger, but it works quite well as a sort of piano ballad. <laughs> 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 With some gabba donk. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm looking forward to it. As long as Cammy likes it. <laughs>
Libby Learmon says, first time hearing you. Keep up the good work. Hey, hey we've got a new fan. Thank you so much, Libby. Hey. Glad to have you here. Um, Mary Knox says, to keep it in the family, here's Lucy's auntie for going the girls' <laughs> footy to watch the show. Hey. hey. <laughs> and, uh, no balls in here. And uh, Candy Sparkett says, uh, I'm loving all of this. Tell them they are wonderful. Hey, thanks, Candice. Thank you um, That's brilliant. Are we getting to the end of the... Two ah, great. It's not the last one. That's brilliant. <laughs> but you know, if you, if you do want to see the rest of it, there's there's a couple more tunes that we're not playing tonight that we'll be pulling out on this Friday in Room 2 in Glasgow, and then we'll be playing them again in the Mash House in Edinburgh on the 23rd. The 23rd. Great. So, so cool. And let's, uh, let's do uh, a couple of plugs. I, if you want to give us some cash, you can. You can uh, go to the website. I'll, I'll copy that link into the comments. And you can donate some money, and we will split it between us. And probably we'll get more out of uh, 10,000 plays on Spotify, um, I would reckon. Yes, please. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> um, and uh, we, we, we will split that money with, uh, with the band. Uh, and... We've got T-shirts for sale. Hey, hey and I, I, th I ran in there and I threw one on the floor. Yes. Um, Thank you, Gary. Uh, can you hold that up, Gary? And can get it on? Can you get that on That's camera, it. Tom? Hey. So if you want to buy those, we've got men's mediums, uh, but they're quite big mediums, and uh, my girlfriend fits quite well in one. So, so there you go. Amazing. Um, Thank you, Gary. Um, Cool. Uh, don't go anywhere else to donate. Just go to the website and use the donate button. Don't follow any links anywhere. It'll be someone in another part of the world who'll steal all your children, sell your granny, and empty you out your house. So there you go. Be warned. Um, what's the next tune? This one is called Long Bath. Somebody uh, having a long bath, Brenda? Sophia filmed her feet in the bath and used it on... I saw in the that. <laughs> in the Mercedes Gleitz and stuff. I just saw that on the background. Oh, that's fantastic. That was really good. <laughs> I was wondering where that came from. That's dedication. Well done. Uh, that was uh, in Gala Shields <laughs> in the bath, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's why it took you till, uh, till, till 7 o'clock to get here. Uh-huh. It's waiting on the water heating up. Um, <laughs> Really appreciate it. Thank you, Sophia. Sophia's doing a, a grand job tonight, so thank you. Yeah, cheers. Okay. Well, thanks, Dave, as well. It sounds great. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm delighted, honestly. This is, this is my Saturday night. It's better than a Saturday night, actually, yes. for me. Like, so. Is it Saturday? No. It's not. It's Tuesday, but I'm always, I'm always working at the weekends. It's Saturday of the mind. Yeah. 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 Uh, Piano drum with um, the wonderful Sandy Butler. We filmed and edited them, so if you keep your eyes peeled, this is this next song is the next one that we're going to put out. Gary, do you want to tell the story of the song? I'm good. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God. Uh, um, uh, yeah, I was looking for a name for this track, and a story kind of crossed my path about uh, the actor Spencer Tracy, who was. Uh, an actor during the golden age of Hollywood and between jobs when he had too much downtime he would check into a hotel with a big steamer trunk full of whiskey strip naked, climb in the bath drink whiskey for weeks on end and just use the shower to hose himself off when he soiled himself and uh, I don't know something about that just <laughs> I'm right <laughs> okay you know, it's never good when you've got too much downtime that's all I'll say ah, yeah, it's true Aye. Try not to think of that. It's a nice tune. Okay. <laughs> oh, sorry. Aye. Two seconds. We're all good. I, I, I... Yeah. It's always the first line that I forget. It's this first line is fine, but the next first line I might forget. Cool. Will the I next first line not be the second line? It's that line. Right. The first line to the first verse. I remember the second line. I just can't remember the first line. Cool. I'll figure it out. Sweet. <laughs> 
And, uh, you know, I'll play the album over and over and over again, too, so. Sweet, nice one. Have you got it for now, though? We are live. There's an audience I hear. I Sweet. Okay, cool. Let's do this all. Can I get the first chord, please? Thank you.
Just a shell. And I, I managed not to cheer in the false ending. Hey. hey. <laughs> Brilliant. Hey. <coughs> Scott uh, McCafferty, uh, he says he's scared. No. He says, no, I'm fine. <laughs> uh, uh, and uh, is that Scott from Bombscare? Aye. It is. And what's his brother's name, the trumpet player? Colin. Colin, yeah. Cool. I haven't seen them in ages. I saw them yesterday. Aye. Um, I've got Colin's crowbar in my car. He's what? What? <laughs> <laughs> Lisa, Lisa and Colin have been out housebreaking together. Um, Actually, that's not true. Sorry. It's definitely not true. Are you he helped us open some windows. Oh, I see. Right. It's, 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 all right. No, I got. I get it. I get it. So Colin's a big guy with the muscles that can bust things, and you're the you're the wee guy that can crawl in the. This is, this is like a jewel thief. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There's a couple of twins at my school like that. Like. What's the um. um Come on the mic. Speak on the, the oceans. Is it Oceans Eleven where they got the small person that fits in like a suitcase and? Yeah, essential for thieving things. The small, small people. That's yeah. me. Yeah, yeah, Absolutely. Yeah, not not that I'm an expert or anything no. like that. Indeed. You know. um, this window would be fine. It's, it's a pretty big window in front of me. Yeah, Libby. Libby says, uh, and I'm with Libby on this one. I'll never see Spencer Tracy in the same light again. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah. Yep. Yep. <laughs> Moving on. It's like uh, so we're we're down to the last tune. Indeed. Aren't this we? Is this is a title track mm -hmm. of the album. The album yes. title track, which is part machine. Which part? <laughs> which part? Well, as, as we've mentioned, you know, we did all of this remotely during lockdown, and. Um, you know, so it is. It is part it machine, isn't it? it You've is. got well, like it's sort of about it's sort of about interacting with people exclusively through technology. Yeah. But then you know, I suppose we're also like kind of a folk band that use lots of synthesizers. So is that guitar kind of a piece of technology, too. Callum? I can't hear you, Lewis. Oh, <laughs> I assume Lewis just said something. But he did. Let me. Where's uh, Lewis? He's oh, okay. Right, say that we again, don't Lewis. Need to hear Lewis. No. It's fine. Just, I'm just saying, you know, your guitar is a piece of technology. Nah, man. It's part of me. <laughs> <laughs> I like uh, Elon Musk's description of the corporation as a cyborg. It's like, so you've got thousands of people and they're all connected through uh, technology. So we're all te technologically assisted, you know? Mm -hmm. You've got a, a, a whole library, every library in the world. Yeah. And you in your phone, you know, so we're... That's it, the sum total of all human knowledge, and uh, I mostly use it to look at funny videos of cats and dogs. I don't know about you guys. Uh, that counts as human knowledge, yeah. knowledge of fun things. Um, I was going to say, so talking of which as well, we've got that beautiful background behind Callum, which um, Sophia is showing off, which is our um, album cover by Johnny... Henderson. Henderson. <laughs> not Hector, <laughs> not Horace's. Henderson. Johnny Henderson. He's made up this uh, incredible um, poster for us. Um, it's supposed to be kind of about us, so you might find some bits and pieces in there that actually represent us. It's, it's like your version of the numbskulls. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's exactly what it is, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that's, yeah, yeah, no, that was, um, that was the first thing that Lissa said when she saw it, and we were like, double down on that. Yep, <laughs> yep, brilliant. Yeah. For sure. Um, uh, just quickly, while we're here, I suppose other people that we should thank include uh, Kirsten McEwen, who has uh, been doing a bunch of good stuff for us. On She's been helping us run our social media accounts, which is all of our least favourite part of being a band. And all of our recent photos as yeah, well, she's doing, done. Doing loads of photos. Uh, so thank you so much, Kirsten. You can follow her, Kirsten McEwen Photography, on Instagram. And you should, because she's an awesome photographer. Um, There's and Sandy yeah, Butler who did S our videos. Sandy Butler, shouts to Sandy, who's done some video stuff for us. Uh, and yeah, Johnny's Johnny, the designer who did this artwork, his outfit is Ship Shape Studio. So it's uh, Ship Shapes <laughs> dot io. Stunt. Easy Stunt. for <laughs> dot io. Easy for you to see. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> brilliant. Uh, see, you guys have been busy, and that's great. It's fantastic. And uh, I'm just looking through the window here, and. Uh, Spruit, you all look brilliant. You know, <laughs> thanks for coming along to my Saturday night. And, hey, and for having us on, Dave. Yeah, delighted. I'm delighted. Uh, give us the last tune. Uh, 
You can donate at olympictv.com if you want to give us some cash, and you can buy T-shirts there as well, and all that money will go into doing more of these shows with more fantastic bands. Okay, here's the last one.
Hey, 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 hey. Uh, so that was brilliant. Uh, really good fun to mix. Quite, uh, quite tricky to find out where the, where all the parts are. Because you've got like, if people could hear what I can hear, because you can listen to the individual instruments. So you go, oh, there's a banjo. Oh no, it's not. <laughs> it says something. In, oh, there's a flute. Oh no, it's not a flute. You're yeah. Like, um, it's brilliant, Lewis. Uh, what fun you are. That's great swirly. Yeah. Miss in there as well as jumping up and down. And there's, there's one last remark. Uh, Scott McCafferty says, Lewis's glasses are technology. <laughs> so there you go. There you go. Um, I'll say thank you once again and bid you good night. Um, and I'll have one more cheer. The three of us. Here we go. Yeah. Yeah. There thank we go. You. That was thank her. Thank you so much. Cool. Uh, Cool. Good luck with the gigs, uh, everybody. Uh, you can get out and see them uh, uh, this weekend in Edinburgh and next weekend, uh, next weekend in Glasgow. Next week, Friday in Glasgow, a week on Saturday, the 23rd in Edinburgh. Yeah, and you'll get the whole album and some extra tunes that you haven't heard with an international cast, and you can jump up and down with Lewis, who I think will... You do that on stage, don't you? Yeah, yeah, he does. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, the fabulous uh, Yoko Pono... Uh, Good night, guys. Uh, coming up, uh, we've got uh, a number of things you can see in the titles. I'll have a quick look in the calendar. We've got Minerva Wakes coming up. Um, and who else do we have? Uh, we've got some new bands, which I think will be uh, really good. We've got Maz and the Phantoms from Glasgow. Uh, they seem very energetic. And... Who else do we have? Uh, Kyoshi Station are going to come in as well, and the renovations and exterior is going to come in with the, uh, an electronic set and his own VJ guy. Um, so tune in, uh, buy a t-shirt, uh, send us some cash to the donations link, um, and be well. Good night. <laughs>